Hey guys, happy Thursday. Today is kind of an exciting day. He heard me say happy Thursday, so he's running to his ball. You're too hot, aren't you? It's hot out today. Whew, yeah, it feels like summer's here. Um, it's kind of an exciting day. I'm gonna go meet my mom's new puppy. She hasn't had a dog since I was in my early 20s, I believe, is when um, the last dog she owned passed. And I'm 50. <laughs> so it's been a long time since my mom's had a dog. She's an animal lover too. She has a couple kitties. Um, but she decided to get a dog. And um, she got a mini Aussie. So I've got some running around to do today after I feed the boys their lunch. Um, look at them in the new grass. <laughs> yeah, after I feed them lunch, I've got a Go take a couple things back to the store, some returns, and um, I thought maybe I'd pick up a couple little, um, maybe a package of bully sticks and um, maybe a couple toys for the new puppy when I go meet him. So, it's, an, it's a boy and his name is Bandit. And from the pictures and video she sent me, he's really cute. So I'm excited to meet him. So, and I know the boys are gonna be very jealous. <laughs> very jealous when they smell a doggy on me <laughs> yes so that's gonna be interesting every time i go anywhere and i pet any dogs the boys are upset and sniff me up and down just like they do the other boys um when they come home from the vet and they smell smells on them that's what they're gonna do to me probably for at least 20 minutes <laughs> there's grant up on the porch yesterday I barely had his cone on him he's been leaving his eye alone so I'm thinking that's another good sign that the um, corneal ulcer is going away because it's not bothering him uh, to where he's wanting to paw at his eye so I barely had his cone on him except for when I had to put those one eye drops in um, and I do try to get them warmed up in my hand some people were saying to do that I do do that but it's still uh, for like 10-15 seconds it just when I put that drop and it bothers him so I do have to put his cone on um, when I give him those drops still so but I'm thinking it's another good sign <laughs> that he hasn't been messing with it so hopefully it's starting to go away and heal up so all right guys it's hot everybody's panting we're gonna go in I'm gonna feed these boys lunch and then we're gonna head out and go meet my mom's new puppy. All right, I just went in, I did a return and I got the new puppy a little gift. And of course I had to get a gift bag. <laughs> so I thought I'd share with you what I got the puppy. I got some uh, cadet bully sticks. They are the um, 12 inch long bully sticks but I figure um, you want them a little longer because when they get to about this point down here you want to get rid of them um, but if they feel it's a little too big they can my stepdad has tools he could cut them in half half if he wants to so got that I got a little rope toy with a ball on it and then I got this ball here which my boys have this ball and they love it they were actually taking turns last night, taking it away from each other, playing with it. He, Mr. Grant was um, doing circles in the house with it. And it was funny because he was going around the circles and you'd just hear a squeak every now and then. And you'd hear him coming closer and closer <laughs> to come back into the front room, into the schnauzer room with it. It was so funny. So, yep, that's what I got the little puppy. I got one more stop to make and then we'll uh, get to my mom's house.
right, we're back home. Wasn't that puppy so cute? He was so cute. The dogs aren't really on me because I really didn't pick the puppy up. I let him just kind of run around on the floor and pet him that way. So the boys haven't noticed that I was around another dog. <laughs> oh, my mom um, doesn't have her air conditioners in the window yet. So it was quite warm in her house. And the puppy having lots of hair, he was trying to find cool spots to lay. And I told my mom that she should get a cooling mat. So, Mom, if you're watching this, you should get that baby a cooling mat. Um, yeah, so he's very cute. And if you notice, he was laying in my niece's um, dollhouse. Uh, my niece and my sister live with my mom. And he was laying in there eating the bully stick I got him. He really liked it, too. <laughs> really liked it. Um, so, anyways, he's a cutie. So, now we're home. Sitting outside with the boys for a little bit like Milo was rolling in the grass. My neighbors are outside, so if you can hear little kids, they're in their pool next door. Wish I had a pool. <laughs> I turned the heat off on the hot tub. And I'm going to use that for my little pool to float in in the hot days. Yes. That's going to be my pool for the summer. <laughs> oh, no. Their dad was yelling at. He was yelling out to his kids. Now all the boys are going to start howling. Boys! Boys! <laughs> Magnum, come on! Come on! We don't need to yell at our neighbors. No. Go on. We don't need to yell at our neighbors. Let's go. Come on. <laughs> oh my goodness. I try to I try to keep the boys from barking because I'm sure it would annoy people. Uh, it would annoy me <laughs> if they were barking and barking and barking. He's just talking to his kids. You don't need to bark at him. He's just talking to his kids in the pool. Yes. All right, guys. I'm going to get going. I think I'm going to sit out here just for a little bit because it's warm. It is toasty today. It's going to be almost, I think it's going to be almost 90 tomorrow. <laughs> Um, but yeah, my mother-in-law is not feeling well, um, so kind of waiting for my husband to get home and see if he's going to take her to the urgent care tonight or not. I'm not sure exactly what's going on. He didn't really tell me what her symptoms were or anything, but she's not feeling good. Um, so we need to figure out what's going on. So I'm going to get going. Hope everybody's having a great week and enjoying... Hopefully you have nice weather and you're enjoying it. I got to go get Magnum. All right. <laughs> I got to go. Bye.